Hey guys, what's up? It's Big Marv here, and today we are going to be finishing the design on my Electrophonics um, build. So, my developer and I, we spun up this Shopify store to sell electronics, uh, first of all, because, you know, we're a web development company, and, you know, selling small electronics and parts that go with electronics just goes hand in hand. Um, so... And I also wanted an e-commerce platform that I could do demos and stuff with for you guys in a live environment. So it serves two purposes. Um, so today you guys are going to see me finish the design on this uh, on this build here. Give me a second. Got to log back into ClickFunnel. All right. So you can see we have our electrophonics leads here. So yesterday I got the basic design down. Uh, today I finished shooting the video that I'm going to actually be using. So I'm going to jump over to YouTube and upload the video. I'll make it public. Wait till that done. Just give me a minute. What's up, Paul and Joe? Always good seeing you guys on my feed. Man, nobody pointed out my typo. Man, it's Twelve seconds, ten seconds. You know, just building these sales funnel, trying to make some money. Ninety five percent almost there. All right, I'm going to pick the craziest looking thumbnail. All right, let's publish this bad boy. Right, he got that right. Hanging loose in an uptight world. That's a perfect saying. <coughs> So get 30% off your next purchase with Electrophonics. Enter your details below for the promo code. We got my video here. The action for the button is set to submit order, submit form. So that's good. Copyright. I'm going to put this. Mm -hmm. Electrophonics. All that keyboard. All right. And now I'm going to check my SEO metadata. I'm going to change this to...
and keywords. We'll do e-commerce and electronics. I'm going to see if I can find a list of keywords. But okay, let's see, let's see if I'm going to actually get it. Second, let me check my email. Bunch of spam now. That's why I created an email address just for that shit. Let me see. Yeah. Oh well. Let's try to be just something else. Let's see. Here we go. It's a dock. So let's see. Well, that's pretty cool. Let's see. I'm just going to keep winging it. So, smartphone flash does hard drive. Helped if I spelled Android right. Nokia. Um, portable. Charge. Battery. Charger. USB. Cord. Cable. We'll just leave it at that for now. I can always go back and add more. So this is what it's going to look like on search engines. Alright, save that. That looks good to me. Alright, so now i got to do the thank you page. Oh shit, I just got that list of keywords. Let's see. See, that's what I was looking for. Let's edit the 
thank you page. So I'm gonna get rid of this. Modify this setting. Get rid of this image. Make the background color black. Get a little bit of transparency. This and make sure it's on it. Make it do this over here. Own it. Go to the settings here. Settings. Paint color. Let me get rid of this section. All right, I'm gonna get rid of this and this. All right, and then I need to actually make a code. So give me a second. Give me a second. Oh, there it is. All right. So you just click discounts on the left. <laughs> Usually I have a code open coffin. Um, so I'm gonna create a new one. So create discount and we're gonna say Oh, customers will enter this code discount at discount. Um, thirty entire order, everyone limit this to one per customer, track via email, save. Alright, so now what I can do is create this and say paint color Of course, I can't see shit. All right, and I'm just going to add a button. I'm up. 
cut the action. And it's going to go to HTTP colon slash slash electrophonics.com. Open in the same window. Back. This advanced and let's go to this. Okay, that's a let's do this. Let's make it slow. All right, and then I need to add an element with the headline. We're gonna put thirty. All right. All right. Setting bold color white. All right. Font size. Let's make it big. Save thirty. Shop now. Alright, cool. Boom, 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 boom. That works for me. Let's preview this bad boy. Cool. Let's make sure my link works. Cool, it does. Alright, so now I'm going to do the SEO metadata. And then Arthur Electrophonics in his URL. All right, let's save that. Cool. All right, now let me exit that. All right, so now one of the things I got to do to make it functional is um, use Mailchimp. So we log into my Mailchimp account. That two FA. Hell no, don't skip it. I don't know if somebody to try to hack my shit. Alright, so I'm going to create a list just for electrophonics. Electrophonics. Subscribers. Default from email address. Support at electro. Electro. 
Retropod. Retropod. Turn off that double opt in. Fuck that. And I do want a one by one every time somebody subscribes. I like seeing that notification. My computer can handle all the Asian porn you can throw at it, bro. You know that. <coughs> All right, now after you create the list, you have to create a campaign to go with this. So we're going to create an email, automated, welcome new subscribers. Campaign name, it's going to be Electrophonics. New subscribers. And then we're going to select the Electrophonics list again. All right. So this is going to be the automated workflow. Um, so now every time somebody subscribes to my list, they'll get this automated email. So I'm going to edit the trigger here. Instead of waiting a day, I'm going to make it immediate. Update the trigger. So now trigger is immediately after subscribers join your list. They're going to get this email. So now I'm going to design the email. Name your email. Email subject. Electrophonics visit today to save 30%. Coming from Big Marv. Send verification email. <sighs> Actually, fuck. I'm going to do this. Or at. update my funnel too. <clears throat> or Give me a second, let me grab that email. All right, 
so now I got to create some records. Give me one second. I have to make some DNS records so the mail actually works. Talking Studios. And they need a C name record, so let's add a C name. And then the name is going to be All right. So I want to just show you guys the zone editor. Alright, so you can see here after I added the domain, it says I have to add these two zones. So I went into my DNS zone editor. I'm adding a C name record for Coffin Studios. Here's the name of the record and here's the C name. So that's what they mean. So create a C name record for, and then this would be the values, or in this is where it points to. And then next we're going to create a text record. So add the C name record. And then I'm going to add. Won't let me add a text record. Yeah, I don't have the option to fucking add a text record. Let's see if there's some kind of advanced. Hmm. So I'm going to have to email my host and say, what the fuck, guys? I can't add a text record. So, whatever. But I still need to set up the text record, so I'll do that later. Oh, well. Let me see. Let me get that verification code. Fucking get fucked up. All right. Hold on. All right. It's probably timed out.
holy fucking fuck. Check your spelling, dummy. I'm just gonna go with a basic one column template. I'm gonna drop an image. Upload. <laughs> Thanks, Joe. I'm trying, man. Now it's time to design your email. Here is your promo code for your pro offer. Alright, and then I'm just going to put save third image. Center it up. Let's make it big as fuck. Center this up too. Come on. Alright, and then I'm just going to go shop now button. Images. Gonna add an image and upload. Cool, and then <coughs> we have Facebook and Twitter, so I'm going to change this to IG. And then, actually, I'm just going to fuck it, trash for it. Fuck it. Alright, cool. So now, whenever somebody signs up to my list, they'll automatically get this email. Alright. You just hit next. So it says sending is disabled. Let's resolve this. Cancel. Oh, you know why? It's because I got to go back to the list. Exit without starting. <sighs> I gotta fucking go to the settings on this list. And go to here and then do support at coffinstudios.com. There we go. And the email 
Sir, that's cool. All right, so now I'm gonna go back to the campaign. Electrophonics. Now let's see. Let's edit the workflow setting. And then we're gonna do support at coffeestudios.com. Verify domain. And then send us another fucking verification email, you fuck. Ooh, liar. It did not bounce. I got it, you fuck. Let's see. This is stupid. I just do Marvin. Oh, wait. Is that my email I'm waiting for? Oh, yeah, there we go. What the fuck is not invalid? Try this one. Thank you. Fuck. Oh. Finally. I can turn it on. Okay. Next. I'm gonna have to fucking... I'm gonna kill MailChimp. I'm gonna try logging out and logging back in. Something's like fucked with this campaign. So support at coffeestudios.com. Edit workflow. What the fuck? At coffinstudios.com. God damn it. I'm gonna skip this step. I'm not fucking verifying again. It's fucking verified, you fuck. God damn. There you go. Thank you. Ready to send. Shit. Start workflow. Start workflow. Thank you. Fuck. I hate shit. So now I can go back to my funnel and integrate my MailChimp. Action. Add to list. List to add to. Refresh the list from API. List to add to Electrophonics. Do not send confirmation. The reason why. It's because I'm going to send them that automated email I just built. So if you put send confirm, they're going to get a double opt-in. Basically, they're going to get an automated email from MailChimp saying, do you want to be added to this list? Then they're going to get my automated email saying, here's your promo code. So we're going to put don't send confirmation. All right. So now let's preview this. to my list actually I want to preview it from the actual I'm gonna do something else here before I do that all right account I'm gonna see if I've made a domain for this thing yet yeah see settings Yep, electrophonics, electrophonics. Okay, cool. That's already set up. So now let me go to the funnel itself and map that domain to it. You just go to settings and you can see the domain drop down. We're going to go promos.electrophonics.com. Save and update settings. 
Alright, so now if I go here, it should just be, yep, promostelectrophonics.com slash electrophonics lead. Cool, that's my thing. So let's do Marvin at coffinstudios.com. Give me my promo code. Thanks for signing up. There's a thank you page. And then I'm going to hit shop now. I'm going to add something to cart. Add to cart. Check out. Discount. Save 30. Apply. Boom, and they say 30%, so that works. Now let me check my email and see if I got my automated email. Sometimes MailChimp can take a minute to send emails. <sighs> Come on, MailChimp, don't let me down. So every part of the funnel works, but the automated email part so far, I'm just waiting to see if that automated email comes in. Alright, cool. And boom! It's here. So you can see Big Marv. Your savings for electrophonics. And it came from support at coffinstudios.com. Here is your promo code to save for electrophonics. Save 30. Click the button below to save today. Shop now. And it goes to our store. Fuck yes. And I saved my cart. <laughs> Let me get rid of that. All right, cool. Fuck yeah. All right, so now, how am I going to make money with this? Tune in tomorrow for part three of this, where I'm going to actually create a retargeted Facebook ad to show you guys how I'm going to use this funnel I just built to make some money. Thank you guys for watching. This is Big Marv. One love. And don't forget to reach out to me if you need some of this shit for you. Thank you, guys. Bye.